If you are working in an office, you might have different teams like sales, marketing, finance, etc. You can create a contact group for each team and add persons working in that team to the group. Creating separate groups helps to send an email to all people in the group by just selecting the group. To create a group, in the navigation pane, click on people. Under home tab, click on new contact group. Give a name to the group like marketing team. Click on add members. You can add members from Outlook contacts, contacts or from address book or you can add a new email contact and add to the group. Click on Outlook contacts. Select the contact and click on members. Click OK to add to the group. You can also add multiple contacts at the same time. Press and hold the shift key on keyboard, then select multiple contacts using the mouse. Once done selecting, click on members. You can see all selected will be added to the group. If you want to remove any member from the group, select the member and click on remove member. You can see the member is removed. You can press and hold shift key to remove multiple members at the same time. After adding all members, click on save and close. You can see contact group marketing team is added. You can create multiple groups as many as you need. If you want to send an email to marketing team, click on new email. Click on to. You can select marketing team. Click on to, click OK. Outlook displays a plus in front of the group ID to indicate it's a group and not single email address. If you click on the plus, Outlook displays a message. If you expand the list, Outlook will replace the list with members. You will not be able to collapse it again. Click OK. You can see Outlook removes group and adds individual email addresses. You can leave the group without expanding and when you send the email, everyone on the group will get the email. If you click on send, it will send the email to everyone on the group. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.